upgraded from the legendary Soviet T-64 tank, the T-64BV, especially the mod 2017 variant, carries remarkable power, serving as the backbone of the Ukrainian infantry. Although it was born a long time ago and is known as the national treasure, it carries many revolutionary features in design and development. So upgraded variants from this main battle tank line is their very powerful. Ukraine has two T-64 BV variants. The first was born in 1985 upgraded by the Soviet Union from T-64 Bs. The second variant was launched by Ukraine in 2017, also known by the designation T-64 BV Mod 2017. Compared to the previous variant, the upgraded Model 2017 has anti-radiation protection system and is covered with the new explosive reactive armor to help the vehicle better protect against anti-tank missiles. In 2019, Ukraine Prom reported that the Kharkiv armor plant had delivered over 100 updated tanks to the Ukrainian armed forces. The upgraded tanks included new thermal imaging for own crew remove Lula infrared search light, niche reactive ammo modules designed for baroton replacement on T-64 BV tourists, SN4215 network satellite navigation unit, and Libit K2RB digital radio providing secure communications with a 70 km range. An important element of the improvement was the satellite navigation system from the company Horizon Navigation. At the expense of it, it is possible to exchange data with other military personnel online. Information on the tank's location can be received, including to the senior officers participating in the operation. The main weapon of the T-64BV Mod 2017 is their the 2A46M1 125mm smooth broken. It can fire Nike 120 reflex anti-tank guided missiles to destroy enemies from a distance of up to 5 km. Normally, HT-64BV Mod 2017 is equipped with 6 missiles of this type. Analysts also said that the T-64BV Mod 2017 is equipped with a new fire control system called 1A45 ERTs, which helps increase firing accuracy. In addition, the vehicle is also equipped with a TKN4S panoramic viewfinder for the commander and a TPN4E Buran E integrated day and night viewfinder for the gunner. The ammunition loading system has also been refined to help the tank operate more effectively even in high intensity combat conditions. On the other hand, maintenance of this ammunition loading system will also be simpler so soldiers can do it right in battlefield conditions. One 7.62mm coaxial machine gun is mounted to the right side of the main armament. A 12.7mm NSVT machine gun is mounted on the top of the commander hatch, which can be aimed and fired from within the tank. Two banks of four smoke related structures are mounted to the left side of the turret. The new upgraded variant uses a more powerful diesel engine to help the tank move at a speed of 65 km per hour and a maximum travel range of 600 km. Experts assess that Ukraine's T-64BV Mod 2017 version 
is the most powerful in the Soviet T-64 family. It is even said that this variant can completely compete on par with the Russian T-90A. Before the conflict broke out, the Ukrainian army was said to have about 200 T-64 BV Mo-2017 tanks. However, up to now, after more than a year of conflict with many major changes, it is unclear how many T-64 BV Mo-2017 Ukraine still has. In addition to being defeated by anti-tank missiles, the T-64 BV Mo-2017 is also facing attacks from suicide UAVs.